people, how many times has, has your life been screwed up because of other people, well, fucking up? I know I seem boring doing this blog, but this is what my blog is about now. I mean, it's so stupid that when people screw up over or react or get paranoid, it really hurts other people so much. Like with police and federal investigators suing your property or something like that, or labeling you something, or uh, a misdiagnosis from a doctor, them like taking something or giving you a deadly prescription that kills you. Or uh, college is paranoid and starts secret policing kids to make sure they aren't no another V Tech thing. And the V Tech thing was terrible, but uh, a lot of this is going on in some schools. Being paranoid at students because of it. And I understand that, yes, they have a job and they have a right to look at stuff, but still, they would like the right of the individual. Especially since they're over 18. It's so sad how many lives have been screwed up because of other people's mistakes. I mean, not just people who are out to get you, like hurt you. Which of course is terrible, but for some reason I somewhat find it more annoying if a person really tries to help and screws things up. I mean, in certain cases, there are certain cases, like, uh, you guys ever watch Everybody Hates Chris, like that racist teacher? He's a bitch, a racist bitch, and it kind of annoys the hell out of me that, uh, I know it's a TV show, but if there are really people out there who really think they're helping and they're racist toward kids and stuff, and, you know. I guess that's a part of life and stuff, but it really can screw people over. But like, I like people, like this one guy who was wrongfully in prison for 20 years because of he molested his children and stuff. He you know he did get out and he got, it made news, so he got $100 for every day he was wrongfully in prison. And since it was 20 years, that's the only good thing that came out of it, out of that long sentence, but that means he didn't get a lot of money. Though I doubt that money will give him back his youth or give him back 20 years of life. You know, you know people who have a job, like administrators, teachers, and other stuff. Be careful what you say to people. Be careful who you share things with. Because things really spread around and people are paranoid. And sometimes people make all these assumptions about even checking or meeting the person themselves. Once they do screw up, uh, a lot of them are too cowardly or don't want to uh, decline, I mean, or don't want to take phone calls or anything. I mean, they won't talk to that person that they wronged. Uh, kind of like an old bus thing, you know, like that woman, that night, that woman who left that 19 or 22 year old uh, retarded man, no offense, but he was mentally retarded, you know. Uh, he was mentally disabled and special needs. Left him on a bus, well, the bus driver and the bus matron left him on a bus, the matron got in trouble because the bus driver's not the bus driver's job. But either way, I think they both kind of screwed up. Like, what, he didn't, because even though he was sleeping on the bus, shouldn't the bus driver have taken care to look? And as for that churchgoer person, apparently she left that dude on the bus because she didn't want to be late for church. And I don't know, since it made news and stuff in her name, I wonder, I heard that their church community couldn't believe it or something like that. But uh, needless to say, if she does get out or if she does go to that church, you know, she's going to get an earful now. And yes, that was screwing up. So in that case, she, that was a total fuck up. You know, she was an idiot. Fine. And yes, I'm aware she was African American. Fine. So hopefully they'll maybe she'll become an atheist or I don't know. But I, either way, she's been fired from that job, so it's low risk thing since, you know, she's been fired, you know. But it, it just, it really just is not starting to get to me that other people screwing up can really cause so much harm and stuff. I mean, even though, 
I mean, them doing irresponsible stuff, even if they're directly trying to harm you, like they put you on 